Hi, my name is Srikant and I have created some apps related to engineering drawing. I've been trying to create some others as well. Let me first t talk to you about the pro version of engineering drawing app. This app is uh, ability to solve the projection of lines problem. Let me first introduce you to the interface. Above you have two buttons to go elsewhere. Then there's a given data which you have to fold, read from the book. There's a button called as the draw solution button. Pressing which will draw the solution to the problem. And below that, you have some contact information. Uh, here I have this uh, YouTube. You can subscribe to my channel and stay in contact. You have the Facebook page. And at the end, you have our email ID. Let me just go ahead and explain you how to use this app. So just to show you a demo, the data has already been fed. You just have to click on the draw the solution button. And below in the drawing area, the solution of that problem will be presented to you. Below the drawing, you have some measurements which you can use to check your drawing as you have drawn. You can measure, you can measure the, uh, the diagram that you have drawn and check your answer with the uh, lens or the angles that are given here. If they are matching exactly, that means you have drawn exactly. And if there is a mismatch, that means you have done some error and need to improve. So what if you have to give some other data? So you have this much of data which you can enter from another book. You have the true length, which is true length of the line. Inclination with HP and VP are the actual inclinations with HP and VP. HP being the horizontal plane, VP being the vertical plane. Front view and top view lengths are the apparent lengths in front and top views. The inclination of front and top views give us the apparent angles in front and top view. They are called as alpha and beta. Distance of A above HP and distance of A in front of VP are given most of the times in almost all of the problems. You can feed that. Distance of B above HP and distance of B in front of AP. B is the second point, the second end point of the line, and you can enter its distances if it is given in the book. Then comes the end projectors. End projectors are the lines which join the end points of the line in front and top views in the final position. And then the last four are very rare, but in case they have been given, we can feed it. They are about the horizontal and vertical traces. So horizontal distance of the horizontal trace from A, A being the first point, vertical distance of horizontal trace from X, Y, horizontal distance of V, which is the vertical trace, the top of the vertical trace, the distance of that, horizontal distance of that from A, then the vertical distance of VT, VT being the vertical trace from X, Y. So whatever data of this has been given in the book, you have to enter it accordingly. You can also go on to change the angles in accordance with whatever is given in the book. Let me take 15 degree as the inclination with HP, 30 degree as the inclination with VP. Let me go on and change this value to higher one. Distance of A above HP, I'm giving it as 50. Distance of A in front of VP is given as 25. I can go on to change it, of course, as always. So let me make it zero, which will make it appear on XY line exactly. Then when I click on the draw button, the diagram is going to be drawn and I have the diagram here, right here. So this is horizontal and vertical trace, and here you have all the details, exactly as you as they should be. And below, of course, you have the changed values that have been calculated accordingly, and you can make use of these values to compare with your drawing and make sure whether your diagram is correct or not. Thank you for watching. If you want to stay in contact, subscribe to my channel or send me an email. Thank you.